What's going on guys, it's Jamie and welcome back to another video and guys, welcome to the return of the road to 300 kilogram deadlift. Wow, it has been a long, long while guys since we have done one of these. I'm gonna say that my last episode must have been three or four weeks before lockdown, obviously before not training in a gym for four months. If you've seen my last video, you'll know that I returned to the gym a couple of weeks ago, which obviously meant a return to deadlifts, which obviously meant we are bringing back the road to 300 kilos just because we've had four months off guys and kind of a big chunk of this year has just been kind of written off that doesn't make a difference to our goals the 300 kilo is still there and i'm still insanely insanely hungry for it i am more gutted than ever now that i didn't manage to pull that 300 kilos at the gymshark gym um, because i feel like if i did i would have just been able to relax over the lockdown like knowing that uh, I, I had pulled it and i had nothing to worry about when i came back but obviously we didn't, we fucked it. So playing at the back of my head throughout the whole lockdown was like, shit, when we get back to the gym, the 300 kilos is still on the menu. Like I still want it. And guys, I'm gonna go ahead and say that by the end of 2020, I will have successfully pulled 300 kilos because we are not fucking about right here. We are back in the gym, we are back to it and we are back on the grind and we're just gonna keep chipping and chipping away, getting back initially to where we were and then onwards and upwards from there towards the ultimate goal of a seven plate deadlift. So I'm gonna take you guys along for today's session actually only my second deadlift session back since the return to the gym obviously i hit my session last week um didn't forget for you guys wasn't really going for anything too special just kind of wanted to get back into the flow of things and uh, basically focus on not breaking my back and injuring myself substantially on my first session back doing deadlifts so we did actually manage to get up to a 240 kilogram single um and then we did a couple of nice back offsets at 180 nothing too spectacular guys but actually felt really Really well move really well the weight and the mechanics of the movement and everything felt good so i'm confident going into this session today that uh, we can perhaps take that a little bit further or if not drop it down a little bit and go for some more volume but we'll see when we get in the gym but i'm very excited to bring you guys along and if you guys are as excited as i am for the return of the road to 300 kilo deadlift make sure you give the video a big old thumbs up guys because oh my goodness it is so good to be back doing this series anyway we're just sitting outside the car right now i'm going to go in and get myself a white monster for this session it's early afternoon right now I haven't had too many calories today um, sitting around just over 1,000 calories today so so a fairly good chunk of food to fuel the session but you can never go wrong with a little bit of extra kick so we're gonna go inside and get ourselves a white ultra masks on of course Alright guys, so we are getting through these warm-up sets right here. That was four plates, 180 kilos, and that felt very, very smooth today. But rewind it all the way back, guys. We started nice and light there with just the bar. Obviously, we are still taking it very, very easy in these sessions here. Trying not to, you know, rush anything or jump into anything too quickly because at the end of the day, this is still only our second session of deadlifts after like four months off. So trying to keep the injury risk down to a minimum here, guys. So again. Lots of ability work at the start, stretching out those hips, getting everything just nice and loose and warm before the session. And that brings us back to where we are now. Just warmed up, as I said, with the four plates there. So we're going to chuck another one on, guys. We're going to go for 220, another warm-up set. And we're going to see how it's moving today. It must be, I'm guessing, about 643 degrees Celsius in here today. Fuck me, I am melting in here. These deadlifts are going to be a challenge today, guys. But as always, we are 100% up for it. Hoping to pull something cool out of the bag today, especially for you guys watching the vlog at home. We should be able to make this a really, really good session. Let's hop in to the next warm-up set at 220 kilos. So 220, not moving too badly today, guys. We're actually gonna chuck another 20 on there and go for 240, and this is gonna be the final warm-up set today before we go into the top set, which I think is going to be 250 kilograms for a single. I've watched that clip back, and it, it looks fairly good. Like, it didn't stick at all um, or anything like that. The only thing I can feel that I'm struggling with uh, you know, sort of at this early stage back in the gym. It's just that initial speed off of the floor, like that first explosive pull to actually get the weight up. 
Um, just feels a little bit more sluggish than it used to, but it's still stuff that we're going to just have to work on and uh, try and get back into the mechanics of over the next few weeks as we climb back to where we were before lockdown. And yeah, you know, I'm up for the challenge because, as you know, deadlifts are just one of my absolute favourite movements. So working on this movement in any regard is going to make me a happy guy. But as I said, guys, one more warm-up set right here, 240 kilos. So let's see if we can rip it off the floor. Okay, you guys don't understand how happy I am that I managed to pull that. I really just wanted to prove to myself that I'm not a bitch and I have still got it in me to pull some weight off of the floor. And that was a real test that was. Oh, I mean, that looked way, way slower than it would have done four months ago. It makes me feel two ways. It makes me feel kind of fucked off about the whole situation and that we've probably dropped so much weight off of the deadlift. But then, on the other hand, it makes me just feel happy that we're actually able to get in, back into the gym already and uh, and literally just start working on it again and getting back to where we were because I fucking love deadlift so much and it was the one thing when we went into lockdown that I knew I was just gonna miss so much and I was just upset because I knew that I was gonna lose strength off it it was just a whole mess really but 250 guys that's gonna be the top single for today we're coming back we are slowly slowly coming back that is a 10 kilogram progression on last week's single as well um, so yeah, I mean, if we can do that every week, then uh, that'd be nice, but I don't think it's going to be quite that easy, obviously, but uh, progression is progression, guys. And if we can slowly but surely come back to where we were, I'm going to be happy. Fuck, that almost killed me. <laughs> Honestly, I had to sit down like straight away there. It was so hot in there, I thought I was going to pass out for real, but we got it. We're going to drop back down to the back offs now. And last week we got sets of five at 180. So we're going to keep it to 180 this week as well, but we're going to try and add a rep to each set and just go for two sets of six. All right, guys, that's going to finish it off for the deads today. I feel completely beat already. Those back off sets absolutely take it out of me. But we beat last week's. Uh, we got the sets of six up one rep on each one rather than the sets of five last week. So happy with that. Very successful deadlift session all in all. But I'm going to catch up with you guys at the end of the video in just a little bit. But for now, I'm going to quickly go and get an arm pump right here. As I said in my last video, we are just keeping it strictly with the compounds in these sessions. So I'm not going to hit a hypertrophy back workout now like I normally would do. I'm just going to go get a little arm pump and then we're going to shoot off home. So that is going to be it for this week's video guys and for the comeback episode in the return to the 300 kilogram deadlift. Just to recap quickly for you guys there, we ended up getting the single at 250 kilos and then we got two back off sets of six reps at 180, which as I said is progress on the last deadlift session before the one you just watched, um, which means obviously things are going in the right direction. And I have actually hit a deadlift session since this one as well. And the highlight from that one was a double at 230 kilos. So all in all guys, things are going in the right direction. I mean, it's gonna be slow progress for a little while anyway, until we can kind of get that muscle memory to kick in and uh, you know get the strength back to exactly where it was before lockdown. But that's what we're here for. It's all part of the fun, guys. And I'm excited that I can begin to bring you guys along on the journey as well in this series because if you guys thought I was going to be stopping because of lockdown you were wrong if anything guys it has just increased the motivation to want to get this PR in the bag but as I said that's going to be it for this one guys I really really hope you enjoyed this if you did make sure you hit that thumbs up button for me and leave a comment down below and let me know if you're happy or not to see this series make a return because I really hope you are as excited as I am. If you're new to the channel guys or if you just haven't done so already make sure you hit that subscribe button for me for new videos every single week 
and I'll see you in the next one.